U.S. President Joe Biden will give remarks and updates on the storm and about Afghanistan at 4 p.m. Eastern Time on Sunday. Put that in your diaries. CNN will, of course, carry it live. I want to go, though, straight now to Tyler Malden. He is here in Atlanta, but he's monitoring uh, the storm surges and the satellite images. We heard one of those governors saying this will be a tough storm. Is that a bit of an understatement? It's going to be a tough storm for sure, and it's going to be a tough storm for many across the Northeast and New England. Uh, Henri is a, currently a 75 mile per hour hurricane. It's moving to the north at 21 miles per hour, and that forward motion is expected to uh, decrease. So it's going to start slowing down a little bit, a little bit more, and that means that rainfall is going to continue falling in some of the those areas. So it's just going to continue piling up. The storm at the moment is about 150 to 175 miles to the south of Rhode Island, maybe 125 miles to the south of uh, Montauk. You can see it spiraling here on the, the radar image, and we continue to see really heavy rainfall um, push out of New York City, where we had record rainfall over the last 24 hours in Central Park. That rain is now pushing into both northern New, New Jersey, southern New Jersey too. Source City just had a really nice band push through. Eventually, Philadelphia, you're going to get into the mix too. We have seen uh, in some parts of New York five to six inches of rainfall. In fact, Brooklyn has picked up more than six inches of rain. Source City is now starting to see it pile up too, where we could be having a little bit of flooding there, uh, about five inches. Uh, you know, five inches of rain when you're at sea level, that doesn't mix. Uh, the cone of concern continues to take the center of Henri towards Long Island, Connecticut, and Rhode Island. The track has shifted a little bit. Uh, it was shifted to the east just slightly with the 11 p.m. update from the National Hurricane Center. Um, so a direct impact of direct landfall in Montauk is still, still possible, but it really looks like we could end up having a direct landfall somewhere on that um, Connecticut, Rhode Island line as a tr strong tropical storm to low end hurricane. We continue to have the hurricane warnings hoisted for Long Island, Connecticut, Rhode Island. The surrounding regions are uh, under a tropical storm warning in blue. That includes New York City. On top of that, pretty much the entire coastline of New York and the entire coastline of southern New England is under a storm surge warning. Uh, Robin, we could see in those really low lying areas, we could see storm surge get up to five feet in some spots. Wow, uh, that's some pretty serious stuff. Hopefully, 